This music will fill your heart. It will change you if you let it. One of the great things that I get to do is the introductory remarks before our concerts. I'm fortunate enough to walk out and see all the collected faces of people who have come expecting to be transported or transformed or inspired in a way that only music can do. Since the 18th century, Trinity has hosted a great many choral and orchestral concerts, including here in St. Paul's Chapel. Music is our first language. Even before we understand speech or can form full sentences, we understand music and music understands us. heartbeat of a musical community is, is a choir. And I trust everyone in this choir. The commitment to providing music free and open to the public has stood the test of time. We work hard to offer music of all sorts that is reflective of what this city is at its heart. This is the moment love has begun. Maybe there's danger, but that might be fun. One of the very concrete things that the music department does is it practices the exercise of carrying our congregation, our neighborhood, and our city on our hearts. Music for us is a way for people to encounter the divine, to sense the holy, but it is also a way for us to train people in compassion, for us to lift up new voices and important frames of reference for our times. I think about considering Matthew Shepard that involved Downtown Voices, our community choir, but also involved ensembles from Borough of Manhattan Community College. And the fact that all of those groups were invited again to sing in December at our holiday concert. The great month for me is the month of December because it includes the Messiah, a Messiah that is performed uniquely here, a Messiah that lifts up so many voices as part of the story. We live in a very complicated world that demands a lot of us. Oftentimes, the thing that can soothe us is encountering expressions of beauty and connection and community. Our hope is that when people come to our concerts, they will feel invited into that experience, they will feel welcome, they will know God's love and know that they are loved.